Due to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic and the institutional protocols, the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports has opted for community awards to recognize the contribution of the nation's youth towards the development of the island over the past year. Director of Youth, Mary Wilfred, said National Youth Awards, normally staged during Youth Month, was the biggest event staged during the month, and hundreds of young people look forward to attending that event. Because we are unable to host the National Youth Awards this year, we have taken a new approach where we are hosting Community Youth Awards in collaboration with District Youth and Sports Councils, where they come together and they now do the very same thing we would have done in the National Awards, where we request nominations from individuals in the community to highlight the achievements, the accomplishments of young people within that community. Ms. Wilfred noted that the councils did a very good job in ensuring that the young people in both youth and sports categories were given due recognition. She also observed that the community awards had even greater reach in recognizing the work of young people. The National Youth Awards can just give you the top, whereas the Community Youth Awards would extend to greater reaches that we may not have had um, during the National Youth Awards. So I really want to commend the presidents and, and, and um, their team on the um, Youth and Sports Councils, along with the youth workers who are working diligently to ensure that the, the Community Youth Awards meets the required standards. So far, awards have been held in the communities of Choiselle, Groselet North, Labri, and Miku. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.